Hey, my friend. Normally you'd hear the heads up to this shorter podcast, but the only heads up is there are, or there is no heads up. You just have to listen. Just have a listen. It's really important. Warning. 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 You are entering into the unplugged mind of Paul Clough. Clough. Too late. Personal development unplugged. So, my friends, here we are. Well, friends, friend, want to have a quick chat because I'm getting worried. I'm getting worried about what's happening in this world. UK's gone into another blooming lockdown, and I'm starting to feel it in my head. And I wondered what your current experience is. You know, we're all pretty much in lockdown. And this is for, for us in the UK, it's a, well, the third time at least for different parts of the country. And just when we seem to get out of it, we get back into our tiny little bit of normality. For me, it was, I could go to the gym again. I could start and get my routine, doing my exercises, getting into my body physicality wise and just feeling so much stronger. Just not necessarily physically stronger, but stronger in my mental um, regime, as it were, because I was doing stuff, pushing myself. And then it was taken away again. And I thought, well, I was getting really weird thoughts just for a little while. And I do know that there are some people who now we get into this thing where we start to stay in bed too long. We suddenly start watching Netflix, maybe Facebook. Maybe we just all mind-numbing dross things. Now, I'm going to do a longer podcast about what we can be doing, but that would only be me and my thoughts. And we're so much better when we're working together. So I'm going to do my thing anyway. It's it's going to be a longer podcast. I've just started working on it, but I'd love to think about you in, in in your own personal way. So I'm going to be doing stuff with this new thing, you know, It'll have lots of little things that we can start doing and maybe some bigger things. But the real reason, I'm asking, how are you doing? That's the thing. How are you doing? I want to think about mine and yours, ours, our mental health. And obviously mental health goes inside with physical health, spiritual health, every type of health you can blooming well think of. And the thing is, we all have issues. And the thing about that is, It's blooming okay to have these things. Sometimes we think we're totally alone, and you're not. We all, yes, you, me, I have them. I've woken up at night starting to worry for a little while, and I've had to click myself out of it. You know, I've got some skills that I can do that sometimes. Sometimes it takes a little longer. But we do have to acknowledge it. And this is what I'm doing to you. I have these issues I need to work through. And I want to work through them with you. But to do that, I need you to share your issues, your thoughts, your worries, your concerns, anything that's causing you a little bit of anxiety. Because once we nip it in the bud now, we start to work on it, we can make a difference. We really can make a difference. You can help make a difference in me. I can help make a difference in you. And together we'll help make a difference in our friends and family and the people we see. So to do that, though, I really do need you to get in touch. Just get in touch by email, feedback at personaldevelopmentunplugged.com. Just send me that little thing. Just tell me your issues. I've come into two realms and realms. You can if you want. But if you're a little bit, just, mm, just a sentence. This is what I'm struggling with, Paul. That's it. Because if you're struggling with it, I'm probably struggling with it. And other people are struggling with it too. And when we come up with this joint answer, then we can sort things out. And more than anything, once you acknowledge this, if you do think you've got a big issue, blame and get some one-to-one help. There's loads of stuff online. There's not a push for me. You can work with me, but there's not a push for me. I just want you to seek help. And I'll talk to you that, about that as well. How you can seek help. Seek help? Seek help. Get your words right, Cluffy. But I am worried. I am concerned. And I want to make sure that we all come out of this certainly healthy and safe, but stronger. Stronger mentally, stronger physically, stronger spiritually, stronger emotionally, and stronger skillfully. So we start doing stuff now that creates a difference tomorrow. Let's not wait till tomorrow and then go, I wish I'd done it yesterday. So have a think. Just stick that little email down. And I will be sticking out a newsletter very shortly. And 
you maybe use that as the reply. Okay, that's all I wanted to say. This is not a five minute quickie. It's not, it's just me just saying, how are you doing? Really? Not this, how are you doing? Oh, okay, Paul. No, how are you doing really? How are you doing? And how would you like to do? And how can I help? We don't know the how bit because I'll, I'll work out the how I can help. What would you like help with? Anyway, it's your friend Cluffy just thinking about you. Okay, speak to me. Speak to me by email and have fun. Personal replies, always. Anonymity, if we talk about it on air, guaranteed. Your safety, guaranteed. Okay, see you real soon. Bye-bye. Warning, you are now leaving the unplugged mind of Paul Clough. It's time to fly on your own. Be brave, my friend. Personal Development Unplugged.